Hello guys, welcome to Fish Academy. Yeah, today I want to show you the secret and the idea behind this construction. Yeah, you might still be wondering what is this for? Um, what you are seeing here, normally for those of you that have been following me on my on this channel, you know that uh, this actually was a straight pipe where you are where you now where we now have this connection, this connection, and uh, this connection. It was a straight pipe serve, which always served then as an a discharge pipe. But uh, with uh, the construction of a uh, of conversion, which I converted what uh, my point six to an archery, I have to also come and uh, ensure I do a better construction that will serve uh, uh, or will give me a better production. And uh, what you are seeing here is uh, my overflow pipe and my discharge pipe. And as I said earlier, the, the idea behind this, the idea behind this is for uh, whenever the water rises uh, to a certain level inside this archery, then uh, the water will now overflow as what you are seeing here. Can you see this? This now is the level, the level of this pipe, this horizontal pipe is now serving as uh, the level of water inside the archery that you have just seen and uh, this valve here controls this valve you are seeing here controls uh, uh, the overflow the overflow pipe and the discharge pipe this aspect that you are seeing here serves as a discharge pipe which take water completely from the pond but with this water will not go out completely from the pond so whenever this valve is locked as i'm trying to say the idea behind this construction whenever this valve is closed it will therefore not allow water to flow out through through this outlet therefore it locks this entire area which therefore allow water to then build up Water will then build up inside this pipe as water is building up inside the archery is also building up inside this pipe. And when it gets to a certain level where we now have this horizontal pipe, the water will then start flowing out. Therefore, the water inside the archery cannot get over, it will not overflow uh, the line or the limit in which it ought to be and uh, this other valve that you are seeing here serve as the lock once if this valve is locked it water won't even get to this area that you are seeing here so but the idea behind this is also to control this valve that you are seeing here is also to control the flow also so so that the, the 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 water going out of the ashery must be or the water entering into the ashery must be also proportional to the volume of water going out of the ashery and this is the idea behind this construction and don't forget this is fish academy and uh, i told you earlier for those of you that have been watching my video that i'm going to bring you ideas However, you can also do something like this. You see what I'm entering here? There is a reason why, why reason I have to leave it like this. You can also place your pipe. So you can also, this pipe that you are seeing here, as I said earlier, the idea why I have to leave it like this open is for me to actually know the volume of water. Because if the, if the net inside the archery is blocked it might actually reduce the volume of water going out from the archery which therefore if this place is left open you will know that the place is blocked by then the water will not be entering into this 
hole that you are seeing here it will be entering inside here but it will then be falling out from this place and if the water that is if the water is not flowing the way it ought to flow you understand but if the water is overflowing too much from the ashery then it will be dropping out from it will be entering here this time around it will be this way but if the water is not flowing the way it ought to flow it will therefore be this way but as i said earlier this you can also this pipe i'm trying to show you if you don't want to leave it open you can place your pipe like this can you see this you place your pipe like this and uh, you put it this way the water is still flowing the overflow system is ongoing the water is flowing out or about this time around is not open it's a closed uh, system don't forget this is fish academy and if you've not yet hit the subscribe button i will plead um, i will therefore say that you should hit the subscribe button if you are new to this channel what you need to do is for you to watch other videos on this channel there are videos on how to do so many things there are videos on how to uh, feed your fish there are videos on how to formulate your your fish food there are videos on how to construct ashery there are videos on how to do connections there are videos on how to construct your pond there are videos on where and how to get your pellet machine there are videos on so many things on this channel over 100 videos therefore if you have not yet hit if you've not yet um, uh, click on the subscribe button endeavor to click on this subscribe button. Don't forget uh, uh, For those of you that have been calling to appreciate me. I also appreciate your call and uh, In here is my friends. I tell you that I'll bring you update and as they grow I'm going to bring you up there once they are two weeks um, Yes, for those of you that have been calling my friend from Kenya that is about to invite me to Kenya from Nigeria I am so I will ensure I make it up to you as that will be my first trip uh, to Kenya. Uh, don't forget, I've been going to so many places in order to meet with my client to show them what to do. And um, I'm also, I hope to work with you. Don't forget, I can come around any part of Africa, any part of Europe, any part of Asia. You are free to invite me to any place. I will come do exactly what we need to do. We do business together to ensure you have, you, you make profit in fish farming and uh, we work together. This is Fish Academy. Thank you very much for checking on my channel today. Please stay tuned and uh, wait for the next video as they come. Thank you.